Hi, and welcome to my Shazam movie uh, review. Okay, so this is going to be my Shazam uh, movie review. Leading up to, right before I go see Shazam, here is the guy uh, this weekend, okay? Sometime this weekend, okay? So before I, I get started with my Shazam movie review, let me know what you thought and opinion on Shazam. Did you like it? Did not like it? Are you looking forward to Shazam Fury of the Guy? And what you thought on uh, DC and the DCU and comic book movies and general? And what's the, uh, some of your favorite uh, comic book movies in general? You think comic book movies are rated, underrated? DC movie overrated, underrated? All that in general. Okay? So, um, so, uh, Shadam, directed by David L. Sandberg, starring Zachary Levi, Mark Strong, at Sir Angel, Matt Danley Grazer. I don't know, don't know none of the guys. The only one I know is Jackley Levi. Uh, he was in that one by Kurt Warner, American Underdog. Okay, it's like a fake bay uh, football movie. Uh, I think I saw it last year. Okay. Um, Came out April 5th, 2019, 132 minutes, 80 to 100 million, and it made 366 million at the box office. Okay. Um, it's P13. Uh, the credit gave me 90%, the audience 82. Okay. Um, so, um, it's about, um, a, a Billy Baxter, uh, who is a, who gets turned into a foster care parent, who, who gets dropped off as a foster care parent, and he gets a uh, uh, power I saying the name Shadam, okay, and um, okay, so he had foster parent, and um, okay, um, okay, uh, so so he can foster care with the foster parent. And, um, uh, he's 14, roughly 15, and he has powers, just by saying the name, Shazam! And people compare that movie to the Tom Hanks movie, uh, Big. Okay? And, um, and the bad guy, I'm trying to think, uh, what, uh, Dr. Nirvana, the guy with the weird eye, and okay, back to weakness, the guy with the weird eye, and, and he controlled demons, okay, um, so Nip movie made reference, um, to a lot of DC reference, like they made reference to Superman, Aquaman, um, Batman, okay, um, all the, all the kids at the foster care with Billy Baxter stay at the end, or toward the end, or at the end, whatever, uh, get your damn power, okay, and that's how, uh, they help them defeat, uh, the bad guy. Dr. Uh, Devana, okay? 
Um, so, um, and, um, uh, uh, uh Superman makes an appearance at the end, but you don't see his face because, you know, when the movie comes out and, and people wonder why they didn't show Henry Cavill's face because they don't, they don't, we, we still don't know if he was coming back or not. Okay. And that, that background before, uh, uh, Game Gun took over the DCEU. Okay. Uh, now, uh, there are some comic book movies where I don't mind the joke, and then the other comic book movie where I might the joke hurt the run um the movie. Okay, like the first Ant Man movie, um, the joke is fine. Like. Thor Love and Thunder, I would say, uh, the joke, hurt and run, and met, messed up the movie, okay? I wanted more, I wanted more, uh, Christian Bale, okay? The God Butcher, okay? Uh, so, it depends on what type of comic book movie you're going for, uh, but, but with you damn, I think that, I think the uh, the joke and the um, the humor worked well. For Garnet uh the joke worked well. Um, I didn't like the joke in um, Ant Man Two. I didn't like the joke in Garnet Galaxy Volume Two. I thought uh, it hurt the movie. First one was good, perfect. Two down is a perfect with the humor the humor was good. Okay. Um Zachary Levi was good. Um so um so this is my favorite um D C movie out of the D C E U. Okay, so I think all the DC EU movies, Aquaman, Wonder Woman, Wonder, Wonder, uh, Wonder, uh, Wonder Woman 1984, so on and so forth, this is my favorite one. This is the one that I can watch over and over again. Okay, I didn't care for uh, Batman v Superman and all of those movies, okay? Um, so, yeah, so. If you're a DC fan, I would highly recommend this. Um, I had a good time with this. Uh, it's a lot better. Shadam is a lot better than a lot of the uh, Marvel movies in Phase 4. Okay? So, if I had to give it a grade, I would give it like a B plus or an A. That's how much entertaining. And entertainment, I got out of it and fun from watching this, okay? Uh, okay. So that couple co comic book movie I watch in theater or at home, um, I was disappointed, okay? I didn't like Eternal, uh, I didn't like She Hulk, I know that's a TV show, but, uh, okay. So, um, So, uh, yeah, uh, Ant-Man and the Quantum Mania, I wouldn't say I totally hate it, like the critic does, uh, I like Kane, he was good in it, so that's probably the best thing about Ant-Man and the Quantum Mania, Ant-Man and the Watch and the Quantum Mania, so I highly recommend it, okay? So, thank y'all for watching, and I hope uh, Shadam and Fury of the Gods did not let them. Okay? Thank y'all and until next time. Shadam!